all done. I was testing out like wearing shorts with high socks on it compared to pants. Don't do it, wear pants. It gets you in the kneecaps and it hurts. All right, it's 2.15. Someone's coming to see the house at three, so we have to leave. It uh, be gone by 2.45, so I have to be showered and dressed and out of here in 30 minutes. I think I can do it. I got shoes, I got a shirt, and I got service. We ready to go. So we all cleared out of the house. Someone's gonna come view it in 15 minutes. And I'm going to Allison's house because I hate driving around and I like going to do something while people come view the house. She's like, hey, come chill by the pool. It's 4th of July, come hang out with me. Happy 4th of July, by the, guy, by the way, guys. So I'm going to Allison's house. The only plan I have is one, chill by the pool, because it's 90 something, five degrees out. And then two, later tonight, we're going to watch, she has some place to go watch fireworks. And I was like, yeah, sure, I'll come. I got nothing to do. Me and my family didn't plan much. With such a big family, we normally don't plan or execute um, celebrations of large events like this, <laughs> like 4th of July. We normally don't do fireworks because they're really expensive. And we're in a town where we're pretty much close enough to everything so where to where if you, someone has fireworks and setting them off, we're pretty much close enough to see them anyway, so it's kind of just like, just watch others, why buy our own? So that's the current plan. Go to Allison's, hang by the pool, and then fireworks later tonight. We'll see you tonight. <laughs> so we pretty much just chilled in the pool all day. I'm trying to get tan, because Allison's like this black old girl who's black. mega tan now, so I call her black. Um, I'm, I'm okay, I'm, I'm okay. Uh, we're going to watch fireworks with Allison's youth pastor. Okay, should be fun. Look, it's it's 8:30. Look how bright it is outside. And it's 8:30. Like, what? This makes no sense at all. It looks like you're taking me down some creepy road to like murder me, though. I might be. I'm a little scared right now. Everybody, say goodbye to Ethan. <laughs> That's horrifying. I've seen a lot of horror movies. So I'm not terrified of them like you. So you said we're going to your grandpa's. Yeah, if I can find it, I don't know where it is. You don't know where. So we're going to like to some empty field that her grandpa owns. He doesn't own it. He leases it. He leases it. And correction. So that we can watch some fireworks that are going to go off in the distance. And her pastor and his son are behind us. So we kind of like tried to gather a small group to go. Because but he has a truck. I'm just inviting him because of that. Not because I like him or anything. He has a truck that we can sit in like the back of and, and watch instead of sitting in the car and watch. Because, yeah. um, I mean, fireworks, you want to be like as close to them as possible. Even though we almost um, died last time. Yeah, remember when we almost died? Oh. Oh. <laughs> so this road's getting more sketchy and more sketchy. Call you back, brother. Let me figure what out what we're doing. Look how tall this grass is, though. All right. Bye. So we're gonna hop in the truck over here and hey, keep going. We got a ride with you. Grab his drink. All right. Go. America. Top of the hill. Yeah, you can. He said you can't go past the fence. Oh, you can't go. Yeah, past you can. The fence. I'm trying to remember the instructions her granddad gave me on how to get here. Or how to get to like the best spot.
peace of mind I know it's hard sometimes Yeah, I think about the end just way too much So I'm home now and it's 11.30 and I half forgot I have class tomorrow morning at college at, I have to leave at 8 a.m. I also, I, I didn't forget about the homework, however, so I knew about the homework, which I, in my mind, planned I would do tonight. And then I was out watching fireworks and I was like, hey, we should probably head home soon. I got class tomorrow. So it's 11.30, but I'm going to finish up some homework. Today wasn't much, there wasn't much to vlog about. I went to Allison's house. We showed the house, so we had to clean it up today. I went to Allison's house because we had to leave, and then um, floated in the pool for like an hour and a half, just tanning, just like chilling, just like on the tube, just talking and like soaking up sun. Take advantage of it while I can here in Florida. I mean, that's pretty much every day that you can take advantage of it, but I don't get to all the time because I don't have a pool. And then um, we were going to watch The Bachelorette but for some reason it wasn't on, even though it's supposed to be. So then we went to see fireworks that were like right down the road from her house with her pastor. I said youth pastor earlier, it was actually her pastor. So that was chill. You saw the fireworks though. Uh, we were in a field and we were just like watching them from afar and then drove home. Now I'm here doing homework and then tomorrow starts the week again. Happy 4th of July, everyone. Hope everyone is safe if you're not in America and don't even know what the 4th of July is, which I don't know if that's a known thing. The 4th of July is the day America got our independence, so we celebrate our independence, that's what that is. Um, I'm pretty sure everyone knows about that, but I'm not sure. I don't. I, I have no idea. So, that's what happened today. Hey, look at that. My cube is patriotic. Red, white, and blue. <laughs> That's cool. Okay. So, homework and then bed. I will see you guys bright and early. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did something awesome today, but not stupid. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye. Bobby! Jump over me!